one power up. Retro 5 moves across. Here comes MTR out of Monroe. Over on the far side. I think it's got blocked on the far side for the Blue Alliance, but they did pick up their switch. Moving back into their position. Retro 5 out of Melvindale starts feeding into the exchange portal. 6190 on the Blue Alliance. Coming all the way across with a power cube. I think they might be going to the top shelf. Let's wait and see. Meanwhile, their partner down the far side, 3698 on the Blue Alliance, is the Crushing Crusaders, and they're just... Sixty-one ninety, going up on the top shelf. There's a levitate engaged on the Red Alliance side. Sixty-nine forty-one, the Retro Five out of Melvindale, just wreaking havoc and filling up their vault. 6190 on the Blue Alliance. That's Willer Run out of Canton working in the middle of the field. Got their arms down, moving in. Willer Run's right there. They have it. They're raising it up. They're moving forward. They shoot and score. Now Willer Run out of Canton. Still working in the middle of the field. Now they fall back. Going across the Red Alliance null zone. Back over onto their side of the field. We're in the end game. With a run making their way up on the platform for the Blue Alliance. They got a six-wheel drive machine. Trying to make their way up. They're almost there. They've got it. Now they're going to try and climb. Getting their hooks above... They got that. Their alliance has a levitate. Willow Run's going up. And time expired. I'm not sure if that was a good climb or not. Here's our scores. And the Blue Alliance wins 225 to 174 and picking up two ranking points, the Blue Alliance.